Hey people, Frank's a man here. Um, working on a video for the drive sprockets for the Scorpion. And I just finished them. Uh, it's actually my second set I had to do because the first set didn't work out. So the pictures I left on the forums uh, is not what they're going to look like. So let me show you. My problem was the... Uh, The metal was too thin. So I kept welding on it, it kept bending, I kept bending it back till finally the weld snapped of the two halves of one side and I could probably fix it but the problem would still be there so I just started over. So that's pretty much scrap. Same thing with the other one. Kept bending and I kept bending it back. Problem's still there, so the problem wasn't with the design, it was with the material. So I came up with uh, another another way to make them. This is thicker metal. If you look at how thick it is, this is like twice as thick as the other ones. This is 3 16 plate steel with uh, square tubing on it so this is the end result and as far as I could tell they're gonna work because I mocked them up and uh, rolled them on a track and they seem to be working okay so did a whole thing in time lapse I don't show how I designed them the uh, that part is on the ATLTF forum I believe page 5 on my build thread for the contest, so check it out. And then uh, I did the whole build of these parts in time lapse, so it might be in a, a couple videos. So sit back and watch. Okay, let's talk about the tools first before I do any work. The tools I use is uh, a protractor, a clear one. Uh, couple size compasses, a pencil, an ink pen, somewhere around here, I don't know. Uh, I got a single link chain, uh, a clear ruler, it's pretty neat, it rolls, and uh, I got a, a sample piece of the, of the axle, and paper for making it, for drawing on it, okay. Uh, those are the tools you need. I didn't really use any micrometers or anything like that. Nothing sophisticated. It's pretty much <laughs> backyard mechanics at its finest. This is where geometry pays off. Okay. Bet you'd learn it if they told you you could build a tank with it, huh? <laughs> 